Good evening. Just a couple of words. Uh, we feel wonderful. Uh, it was our first game against a home side, very strong team. And we won 2 0. So that's excellent. We expected them to push from the very beginning, and they did just that. But we managed to get on top, uh, score the opener. They kicked long balls uh, at us, and we had good defense, luckily. Whatever went uh, behind our defensive line, uh, which was very good, I must say, uh, was saved by our goalie, Tomáš Václík, and I have to really thank him for uh, keeping a clean sheet and uh, securing our win. He put in a perfect performance today. In the second half, uh, you could see the genius of Patrik Šik. Thanks to him, we added another goal and uh, we defended our 2-0 result even though uh, the opponent had many chances. Now it's time for your questions. First one. Uh, congratulations, coach. Can you describe how you saw Patrick Schick's performance? And uh, another question. How did you manage to breathe uh, during his second shot that resulted in a goal? Well, I'm just happy he scored like that. We we know he's a genius. He knows how to finish, and that's why he's there. He first goal was a cross uh, and a header from him, and of, of course the second goal that was something out of this world. We really haven't seen a goal like that from the middle of the field in a long time. He likes to try that uh, in training, and he tried this in uh, one of our previous games as well. But obviously, he's a great footballer. And I believe these are not his last goals here, and he will continue like this. And uh, of course, I managed to breathe, and uh, also during his other chance before he came off, which uh, unfortunately was saved by their goalie, otherwise he would have had a hat trick. Next question, please. Can you hear me? So congratulations. I would like to ask, what does this result mean for the group stage? Does this mean you're closer to um, advancing? We've talked about this and you asked me before the game if this is a crucial game. So yes, it is, but we're nowhere near finished. This is just the start of the road. And if we want to advance, this is a good first step. Sometimes you can advance from the third place with only three points, but it might not be enough. So we have two more games to play against uh, the favorites of the group, very tough opponents. So obviously we will go into these games uh, wanting to win and we will need to get at least one point. Well, what did you like most about the team's performance on the pitch? It was a tough fight. The opponent uh, played uh, in a simple way, long balls, uh, fights, uh, tackles. It really was painful for us. And when we were getting ready for the game, we really had to get into a good mental shape because we knew they were going to tackle, they were going to be aggressive, and they did all that. Fortunately, we managed to get over it in the first uh, couple minutes. 
and then some in some moments we were better on the pitch than them but the scots really played until the last minute they gave it their all they pushed us they pressed they put in fresh players uh, who can really go into it and they were a risk for us but we had a good defense today especially Tomáš Vaclík. Can you hear me? I would like to ask, uh, did you like that after the not really great games, the friendlies before the championship, you managed to get your team together? Of course, we we really showed we are in a good form, good fit, and we hope that uh, we hope that we will show what we have. But in the training before the next game, we will try to be more relaxed because there will not be too much time between the games to train. So we are happy that we are in the peak form and we were in our top form today. Can you hear me? I'd like to ask one thing. Tomáš Václík, uh, how do you assess his performance and can you can you tell us well he's the number one goalie right now because Jiří Pavlenka wasn't traveling with the team how would you decide if you did have both of them who would be number one if you had both of them there um, I don't really want to answer this question, but um, when they both came, because Andrej Kolář couldn't come and we had uh, Václík and Pavlenka as goalies, and they both tried one game in the friendlies and we would have decided based on that uh, unfortunately when it comes to Pavlenka his health decided for him and now obviously Tomáš Václík is uh, our top goalkeeper even though in uh, Sevilla he only uh, played in I think two games but as I've said before the game, he has lots of experience and he showed us that in the past. So I am very happy for him and I really believe he will keep this top form in every game in here. Last two questions, please. Are you happy with... Uh, your substitutions today because Tomáš Holeš was very good and uh, Adam Hložek, uh, Michal Krmenčík uh, and uh, Vidra were all good so they had some chances. Are you happy with those? Well, obviously uh, I sent them on the pitch uh, with their tasks I needed to take off some guys who were getting tired and I think these substitutions were really good. We wanted to freshen it up a bit and they really did and almost scored. We could have been 3-0 up but they worked hard and we are very happy with their performance. Uh, we will obviously analyze it more in upcoming days, but right now after the game I can say they all performed well. Last question please. 
So this is the first game of the tournament. It's important to start well. Uh, is this better for you mentally when uh, you play against Croatia? They will have to win against you because you have three points. Obviously, right now I feel very relieved, but now we have a couple days before we start really thinking about the next game. If we hadn't won today, the next games would be very, very difficult for us, but this is a great result. And I'm not saying we have it in the bag, but uh, we only really need to make one more step, one more point to get out of the group.